All right, we're gonna make a vein here uh, for the marble look. We're gonna use white on a little, probably a quarter inch brush. You, you want to go around here and then smear out later and wipe it out with uh, water. So basically you just dip a little tip onto the brush and you just relax and just roll around. Don't worry about it. Get a little over the edge, you can always come back and fix it. So just roll around and try not to go too close because you want to make a ring, like a little ring. And just relax your hand and try to be as crooked as you can because the marble looks always crooked. So, as you can go around like that already, then what you want to do is come back with the three inch brush. Just kind of tap, tap with the tip of your brush. Tap in and pull down, gently tap and pull down uh, inside a circle, not outside. And then tap in and push in, tap in and push in, and work your way around until you get most of them in, and then on the line here is thick, so you want to just pull it down as much as you could, And then when you got all that done, you smear pretty much all the hot spot out. And then you just wanna come back with your three inch brush and go across gently, gently. Don't put any pressure on it. If you got a little smear, it's okay because um, you can come back and redo it later. You go up and down and across and make sure you Brush is a little clean. If you got a little line on the side like this is okay because that's the natural marble look, so it should be fine. And then just go around until it's kind of a little thin and dry out. <clears throat> just go back and forth, back and forth until you start seeing Start, start seeing a little light on the corner here, uh, which is mean it's starting to dry up a little bit. And now you're gonna apply a little more pressure on it. And go up and down, up and down, sideways, up and down, sideways. Just do a little heart scrub here. Okay, now, now that you got everything there, nice and solid what you want to do and now you can't take any more out because it's pretty much dry out so now you want to stop that and come back with a kitchen sponge or or your regular sponge or whatever sponge you can find just um, soak it with water and squeeze some the water out and go over gently as you see the the paint start to clean up a little bit, so we got some moisture in there. What you want to do is go around with the 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 tip of the sponge inside, kind of circle around. You you, you see it start to come out. The uh, inside of the paint start to come out, and you just work your way around. You want to leave probably about uh, may, maybe three of an eighth or a quarter inch on the line, so. So we're looking like this. So you want it just to go around here before it dries up. Otherwise it's hard for you to take it off. You don't want to take the line out. You just want to take the center out. Just like so. And then when it start to make those lines, you can just go from side to side. 
you see how it creates a line look and then you can just push it from the middle up towards the line just like so push it to the corners as much as you can you see you start to have those marble line look but don't worry about it if you don't get the right the right time in the first place because you can always come back and add more color to it yeah, just like so And just wipe across, up and down. Scrap a little more. You see now you got those look, those line look, like cracked line look on the marble. So just like so. Nothing to it. Okay. And you just clean the whole access around with. Uh, not too wet, otherwise take everything out. So there you go. So now we want to come back with the same color white, white gloss or flat white or semi gloss is fine as long as white. Doesn't really matter. So you want to dip at the point of your brush. If you want to create another one inside, another layer, you just repeat your step over again and just simply apply like that and again come back with your three inch brush on the tip of your brush there just kind of tap inside no push or pulling just tap inside and get yourself some some towel paper towel whatever just Tap your brush so get those uh, white axes out, and then go back and get all the all the remain paint on the wall out, so you doesn't smear all over the place. Just try to tap all that out, and same thing. Now you got all the axes out. You go across gently, side by side, and then up and down. And take some out from your three inch brush or wipe it out with a piece of paper or cloth or whatever you got handy and then just go across back and forth up and down gently until it starts to dry up repeat this process up and down side to side up and down side to side when it starts to dry out, you can put a little more pressure on there so it burns out all those remain pain and then it starts to dry up and it's hard up. And when it starts to hard up, you can feel it. The pain doesn't come out no more and even just start to brush right into the wall. And you can see it start to burn up and it's. Uh, it's pretty much dry so basically come back again with the other sponge that we have um, if it's still wet you can uh, you reuse it otherwise if it's dry you can just re re dip it back with the water and uh, squeeze them out and just go over lightly at first and then start to have some shape and then again on the tip of the sponge, go in the center and uh, wiggle it around circle, make sure it's inside the it's inside the uh, white paint that you just painted. Try to create yourself some line as you see it start to form up. And then start to form out, you just push it in and push out a little bit but don't push too much otherwise you wipe those lying out because it's still wet push it back gently kind of push in and pull out when you get close to the line push in and pull up okay and then when you get to where you want it you like where it is and just go side by side Gently up and down, 
side by side, and then just circle it. Make sure you clean them up a little better. And there it is. And then you'll come back and apply, apply a different color on it. And that should do it.